Welcome to the Accu web hosting video tutorial. Today, we will guide you on how to check shutdown and reboot logs using Event Viewer in Windows servers. If you want a PDF file of this video tutorial, you can download it from our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting. We have mentioned our Telegram channel link in the description. Kindly click on the link and find the PDF file of this video tutorial. Before we begin, take a look at AccuWebHosting.com to review various hosting services offered by us. You can contact us through chat, phone, or send us an email at sales at AccuWebHosting.com. Let's begin the tutorial. First we will know information about what is an event viewer in Windows Server? Windows Server has an excellent tool that saves all activities that are happening on the computer, which is called Windows Event Viewer. The Windows Event Viewer is handled by the Event Log Service. It's the Windows Core Service. Event Viewer is especially useful for troubleshooting Windows and application errors. Event Viewer monitors each user's activities while running the device. It records errors, information messages, and warnings on their Windows server. Microsoft Windows servers might shut down or reboot as the result of a user action or a system event. You can identify the cause by searching the Event Viewer for the following associated event IDs located in the System Event Viewer logs. Event ID 41 It shows that your Windows computer rebooted without shutting down completely. Event ID 6005 It indicates that the event log service was started. Event ID 1074 Your computer records this event when an application forces your laptop to shut down or restart. This event also helps you know when a user restarted or shut down the computer from the start menu or by using Ctrl plus Alter plus Delete. For example, the process X has initiated the restart or shutdown of the computer on behalf of user Y for the following reason. Z indicates that an application or a user initiated a restart or shutdown. Event ID 6006. This event is recorded if your Windows computer shut down correctly. Event ID 6008. At times when your computer shut down abnormally or unexpectedly. Event ID 6013. This event ID displays the uptime of the computer. Let's see how to view shutdown and reboot log from Event Viewer. Log in into your VPS or desktop system. Press the Windows Start button and the R key at the same time to open the Run dialog. Type Event VWR in the text box. Click on the OK button. Event Viewer panel will be open. In the left pane, click on Windows Logs. Click on the System option, under Windows Logs. In the middle pane, you will get a list of events that occurred while Windows was running. You can sort the event log with the event ID. Click on the event ID label to sort the data with respect to the event ID column. Event viewer may take some time to sort logs based on the event ID. 
once the event viewer sorts the logs based on the event ID, you will see logs in ascending order. If your event log is huge, then the sorting will not work. You can create a filter from the actions pane on the right side. Click on Filter Current Log. Enter 41, 6005, 1074, 6006, 6008, 6009, 6013 event IDs in the event IDs field labeled to search all shutdown, reboot and startup logs. You can also specify the time period under log. Click on OK button. Event viewer will filter the logs based on the filter. Let's review shutdown, reboot and startup logs from the filter. There is one event ID 41 in the list. This indicates that the system has rebooted without cleanly shutting down first. This error could be caused if the system stopped responding, crashed, or lost power unexpectedly. You can find out more information about the event from the middle pane. Let's find event ID 6013 to check system uptime. You can check system uptime in the middle pane. Let's find event ID 1074. This event is written when an application causes the system to restart, or when the user initiates a restart or shutdown by clicking start or pressing Ctrl plus Alt or T plus delete, and then clicking shut down. This event ID indicates that process X has initiated the restart, Shutdown of the computer on behalf of user Y for the following reason Z. Indicates that an application or a user initiated a restart or shutdown. You can also check all logs and find out the system shutdown, reboot and startup logs based on the event ID. Let's quickly sum up the context of this video. We saw how to check shutdown and reboot logs using Event Viewer in Windows servers. Hope this video will be helpful for you. If you like our technical videos, please press the subscribe button and bell icon to receive instant notification of our new videos. Each like is important to us so do not forget to symbol us. To download a PDF file of this video, Please subscribe to our Telegram channel, AccuWeb Hosting, where you will have access to the PDF files of all our videos. Thank you for watching.